But we begin this morning with a look at today's eye opener, your world in 90 seconds. I have been waiting all my life and now I just don't know what the hell to say. Democrats pull off an upset in Alabama. Doug Jones turning deep red Alabama blue with a stunning win over Republican Roy Moore in last night's Senate race. When the vote is this close, then it's not over. Let's go home and sleep on it. We'll get out, we'll take it on tomorrow. CBS News has obtained text messages between two senior FBI officials that raise questions about impartiality. Peter Strzok and Lisa Page worked on Mueller's Russia investigation. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson appeared to soften America's stance on possible talks with North Korea. We're ready to talk. We're ready to have the first meeting without precondition. A sexist smear. I mean, that's what it is. A political clash between the president and a leading female senator grabbed national attention. Mr. Trump claimed she would, quote, do anything for campaign contributions. Only if your mind is in the gutter would you have read it that way. Prosecutors have filed terrorism charges against the suspect behind Monday's attempted bombing in New York City. All that? Prince William and Prince Harry at the European premiere of the new Star Wars movie. You're supposed to wear this during the film. And all matters. Laughter adds time to your life. I have hundreds of times stood behind an audience when they belly laugh. I don't know a more spiritual moment. Music to your ears, right? Yes, and time to my life. On CBS This Morning. A little brother watching his older sister during a wrestling match just couldn't stand by, so he took matters into his own hands. Get off my sister! <laughs> that is cute. He actually has to get carted off the mat while the crowd is laughing and applauding. This morning's eye-opener is presented by Toyota. Let's go places. Welcome to CBS This Morning. That picture right there is exactly, guys, why I always wanted a brother of any kind. <laughs> I just think that's so sweet. I know. It's that always young great when, when your brother or your sister is always there for you. Well, and when my son used to wrestle, and when you watch them, you want to go do that. You know, you see your son out there. Of course, that would have banished fun. me from the family. No, you want to stop them from getting their face smashed in the mat. <laughs> exactly that. I'm Gail King with Nora O'Donnell and Face the Nation anchor John Dickerson. There was kind of